Watch the entire video my lovely viewers, I mean from start to finish, to get the whole thing. Without wasting much of your time, let's get right into it. Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. Of uh, not in the ministry, but uh, permanent secretary for Northwestern Province Kenyo Katambi, the Inspector General of Police, District Commissioner, Council Chairman, and other senior government officials. It is my privilege this morning to address the nation through you, my colleagues, members of uh, the press. Colleagues and uh, our members of uh, the public, as you may be aware, that uh, I and my colleague, the Minister of uh, Health, had addressed the nation pertaining to the issue surrounding Honorable Kambu. We are all aware by now that uh, on the 30th day of uh, our first Honorable Kambuili crossed into Zimbabwe illegally. The facts of the matter were given to the nation as to what transpired. But I would repeat for the sake of those who may not have known what actually transpired on that day. On that particular day, Honorable Kambuini, through a Zimbabwean person, had attempted to have him permitted legally to cross into Zimbabwe. The person or agent of Honorable Kambuini had taken the passport to our immigration officer for stamping. When the passport of Honorable Kambuili was presented to the immigration officer, the immigration officer declined to stamp the passport to authorize Honorable Kambuili to cross himself or herself before an immigration officer for formalities. That requirement was not fulfilled by Honorable Kambui. When the agent of Honorable Kambui was told to bring Honorable Kambui to appear before the immigration officer, the agent did not oblige. Instead, the agent and Honorable Kambuili decided to cross into Zimbabwe illegally. That is, members of the press, fellow Zambians, I want to inform you that as a result of the crossing into Zimbabwe illegal, Honorable Kambui became an illegal immigrant in Zimbabwe. As a result of the illegal status, he was holding in Zimbabwe. 
the Zambian government and the Zimbabwean government had to look for Honorable Kambuil. Eventually, Honorable Kambuil was a fugitive in Zimbabwe, was found. And the authorities in Zimbabwe, having taken into account that the gentleman, Honorable Kambuili, had entered into Zimbabwe illegally, they decided to deport him from Zimbabwe. For they believe, and rightly so, that they cannot allow illegality to be perpetrated on the Zimbabwean soil. Ourselves working together with the Zimbabwean authorities accepted and received the deported Chishimba Kambwidi yesterday around 23 hours at the Chirundu border post. I want to dismiss the allegations that are being made by several media, social media platforms which are run by the PF that we as Zambian government mistreated Tishimbaka. <laughs> that is far from the truth. As you may be aware, Honorable Kambwili <clears throat> made a plea to government to evacuate him for medical services outside the country. Despite the fact that Honorable Kambwili was a convict, the government the caring government of President Hakainde Chile acceded to the request and directed the Ministry of Health to evacuate him so that he can get medical services outside the country. The process commenced and it was very advanced. And because Honorable Kamwili had no passport, for there was an order when he got convicted that he should surrender the passport, we requested his lawyers to apply to the court for the release of his passport. And because the government is the one that was facilitating the evacuation for medical services. There was no objection for the release of the passport on the part of government. The passport was given to Honorable Kambu. The Ministry of Health had to find that on the 30th, around seven hours, he was at the Chirundo border post attempting to cross into Zimbabwe. We are aware of the malicious reports that are being portrayed to the news. We would like to thank the government of Zimbabwe for the cooperation and facilitation pertaining to the deportation of Warren Bokambu. Obviously, you would want to know where he is currently. He's in hospital in Minasoko, so that the, the doctors there can assess 
this health condition. We as government, we are always committed to ensuring that we look after our people without exception. And that is why the President of the Republic of Zambia had agreed without looking at political consideration to evacuate Honorable Chishimba Tombe. I repeat, the crossing into Zimbabwe was an illegal act on the part of Honorable Chishimba Tombe. We did not confiscate the passport. The passport was surrendered and left at Chirundu water post. That is the situation that I to this matter. Thank you very much. Unless there, <clears throat> unless there are other issues you would want to hear from us. Let's just, just take it one. Yes. Yes. Pertaining to what you have said about. Sure. Yes. Looking at the, the, the comment Mr. Abu is back in the country, what is the direction the government is taking to show that the, the former Minister of Information will not repeat that? Well, uh, we cannot uh, tell you what other measures are being taken <coughs> pertaining to the illegalities. But we are a caring government. We know we have breached the law. He has breached the laws. But we have taken him to a, a very good facility for medical services, which is minus one. Yes, we care. If there are other issues that will follow, I'm not able to comment. Alright, that's all right for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you, lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutatim Pondum. I love you, peace. I gotta go.